I want to show you what alternate reality Carrie Lake supporters and right wingers, excuse me, um, are living in. And how if you were to go watch on Rumble, let's see here. If you were to go to watch one of these shows where Carrie Lake's getting interviewed, this would be the way the show begins. Okay. I, I came across this and was like, we live in different worlds than so many people in this country because they're not attached to reality at all. It's wild to watch. Take a look at this. Just one of these right wing shows who got a chance to interview Carrie Lake and she's sitting there and they start talking about stuff that is just not attached to reality whatsoever. Whoa, I'm so sorry, guys. That was so loud. Um, and this is the reality that they depict for their viewers. I, these are the front lines. What's going on, Thought Criminals? Welcome to Frontlines. I'm your host, Drew Hernandez. We are here live at AmFest 2022. And I have with me the most notorious thought criminal of Arizona. <laughs> Carizona Lake is in the building, ladies Woo! and gentlemen. Oh my gosh. It is an honor to have you on my show. I am, I, I'm so honored to have you here and to talk to you, especially coming from a position of being a reporter, independent, you know, learning from people that have been down and gone through that lane before me, it is an honor to have Carrie Lake on my show. Thank you. I'm so happy to finally be here and I love the work you do. I mean, some of the viral videos that you've put out have really exposed some of the hypocrisy of the left and, and we expose them every day. And unfortunately, when they are running shady, shoddy elections, you know, we can't beat them until we get our elections straightened out. And that's why I'm always beating the same drum. We have to have honest elections. We have to reform our elections because we can expose the madness of the left. And it's not even socialism. We're talking about communism here. This is not socialism. It is they're leading us straight off a cliff. On the other side of that cliff at the very bottom is communism. And so we can expose it. We can do a good job putting great candidates forward. We can expose the hypocrisy of the left, educate our young people. But if they are running these sham elections, then where where does that get us? And that's what totalitarians do. They rig their elections. They don't. So if you just tune into Frontline with this guy um, and you're watching Carrie Lake's about to come on spitting some truth fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, truth fire. truth fire. What you're going to get is someone telling you that it's over, guys. We're plummeting towards communism in the United States. And totalitarianism has taken over. Our elections don't work anymore. It's all gone to hell. That's what you're hearing. People believe that because sometimes we cover these stories and we get used to hearing, oh, yeah, it's communism, it's communism, it's communism. And... This is a dictatorship. Biden's our new dictator and life's horrible. And I think we assume no one really believes that. But then you talk to people on the ground, for example, when I've gone to Trump rallies, and they really believe some of that. And what shocks me is our education system has failed so brutally that when someone hears Carrie Lake telling them that we're in a communist country, or we're about to be, we're flying through socialism, we're about to get hit communism, they don't go, no, I learned about what communism is. It's not this. Instead, they go, sure, yeah, communist. We're, this, is, we're, this is it. And if you can bring people to the point of that being a reasonable thing that they're told, and they believe without evidence that all of our elections are being stolen by the Democrats, you can pretty much bring them along anywhere. And that's the dangerous place we're in now where one of our political movements is an actual cult. It do doesn't matter facts, evidence, that none of that matters. All that matters is the cult leaders set the truth and they get to depict the reality and then the followers believe it. It is so wild because I just casually came across that when preparing for today's show and watching the beginning to see if there are any interesting moments shocked me that that's just casually how they jump into a discussion. All right, so we all know we're in a communist country. And with that in mind, let's dive into the next thing. We're, we're about to hit communism at the bottom of this cliff. It's just so detached from reality and so sad that people believe that and don't watch this for comedy's sake, right? That would be the only reasonable reason to watch that type of show would be to laugh. But no, that's actually people getting their news, listening to the honest and courageous Carrie Lake. And it's sad. It really is sad. 
and dangerous. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to be a part of what makes this show possible, plus get access to the full video version of the show hours before any of the clips are uploaded to YouTube, plus get a full extra show every single Saturday, you can do so by going to patreon.com slash Luke Beasley. That's patreon.com slash Luke Beasley. And there's a link in the description.